At the 12th, this is Kelly Tan of Malaysia, who has had a really fine season this year on the LPGA Tour, continuing to stack up top 25 finishes. Could she stack up a birdie? Wow, that was worth the wait. Back down to the Jack Rabbit, the 10th hole, Teresa Liu. Another player who played for a number of years on the LPGA, but now plays primarily on the Japanese tour. Whoa! How about that? Eagle there, tying her for the lead straight away. That's a jackrabbit start right there. Here she comes. There's kind of a rhythm to it when you say her name, and you should start working on that name because you're going to be saying it for a long time. Yes. This was a moment ago over at the 12th, par three for Hannah Green, scrambling just short. And I would say that's a pretty good <laughs> scramble. One of 24 amateurs in the field, Amelia Garvey over at the 16th. This was just earlier. One of my favorite golf swings that I've seen in college golf. Uh, she is a star kind of in the making. This is Megan McLaren. And her fourth shot at this par five. And that is how you do it. <laughs> Four birdie from just off the green. Also at even in the early going. Yeah. Bang. <laughs> Was even. You'll take those. A couple of birdies in the last four holes after the bogey start for Suo. And this was just seconds ago. Amy Olson at this short par three today, just 139 yards. Amy coming to 16 at plus one. And yes! there you go. Just seconds ago, Amy Olson lights up what crowd there is there. Again, this U.S. Women's Open being staged without spectators, but what a way to get the one under for Amy Olson at 13 for birdie from Slovenia. She was a senior at Duke in the spring and was a first team All-American and Baylots rolls it in from long distance. That's her second birdie in the first four holes. Behind those uh, autumnal leaves is Jody Ewitt Shadoff. Gonna try and work one around the trees here. Lucky for her, the flag today over on the right side of the green. And she's just gonna go right at it. Wow. And well, we saw one hit the flag earlier and bounce off the green. That one didn't have enough pace. And this is Lynn Grant, an amateur, one of the 24 at the fourth, having a good day so far, even par as she takes aim at this 169 yard par three. It's gonna be another birdie, back to back birdie. This is Sung Young Lee, plus four for the championship. 22 year old. Now one of those many players looking to make her mark in the United States, Pauline Rousson Bouchard from long range. Back to one under. Stand out from South Carolina. I'm sure she's got a lot of Gamecock fans watching. We go to 16 for the amateur again, Rousson Bouchard, 139 yards away. Where we saw the ace earlier. Oh. Wow! <laughs> <laughs> Nearly dropped that one in on the fly. Let's check in with Stacy Lewis at the par four second. Down. Stop. 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 And it listened. Nice one. Bull opens at uh, Pinehurst number two. The men's followed by the women's back in 2014. Here's Sasso at nine. Wow. wow. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. It was smart, too. Tremendous angle coming into that whole location. It's very well protected. And this is another amateur. This is uh, Katarina Don. Not having as good a day as some of the other amateurs, but that will help matters. Especially after a rough stretch here of double and then two bogeys in a row, as you see in her card. This moment ago at the second. 405 yard par four. 
Watanabe just into her second nine, and after opening up with a 37, at the oh, second hey. drops for Birdie, her first of the day. And taking advantage of getting in the field, she got in the field late due to the Andrea Lee withdrawal. And Shibuno from just off the surface for Birdie. Trying to get within one. Tracking nicely for Shabuna. Wow, what a putt to get to three under. It's three birdies in the first six holes on the second nine for Shibuno. Yu Jin Sung at the fourth, 169 yards at Cypress oh. Creek. You like one? How about another one? <laughs> Ingrid Lindblad from Sweden, just 20 years old. All pars, a birdie and a bogey in the last two holes. She did have it to red figures, and wow. man, almost saw another one there. This was just earlier. Had gone the entire day without a birdie. Came here to 18, and have I given it away already? I think you did. Okay. But I still want to see Let's it. Let's just watch and enjoy. <laughs> Schmelzel's finishing birdie putt at the last to get it even. Hey, this was a good round. It's a great round. On the leaderboard here at the open, Lexi Thompson at 15. Earlier with her second. Go. Asking it to go a little bit, and Lexi lined up for what she hopes is her very first birdie of the day. Right there, one under. Oh, beautiful shot by Popoff. Good chance to get the two under. She looked really, really good, optimistic about teeing it up again on the LPGA Tour next year. We haven't seen her in a year. Amy Olsen for the outright lead. Looks good. Looks wow. very good now. Good two there at the eighth. And Amy Olsen to four under par. What a great day it's been, including that hole in one. At five under. Back at 17. Second for Sophia Popoff. Be a pretty good line. Yes, a really nice approach. One of the best we've seen here today. And that should lead to a birdie for Popov. It's been the last, the tough last hour for Song. Hit it in the penalty area on the previous hole and just hasn't gotten much of anything out of this round. Yeah, had a bad mistake earlier, Bones at eight with a triple. But hey. nice way to finish up. Boy, how about the spin on that one? <laughs> 